let me show you how to create social media post in Photoshop. You can download the images in the description down below to follow along. Press Ctrl plus N and create a new document of 1080 pixels by 1080 pixel. This is the recommended size for an Instagram post. Import the background to your main project. Hold Alt while resizing. First, let's create a vignette effect. Add a solid color adjustment layer and set the color to black. Change the blending mode to soft light. Reduce the opacity to about 40%. Select the layer mask and choose a soft round brush. Set the foreground color to black and paint over the image like so. Hold Shift and press Ctrl plus G to group the layers together. Name the group. Import the image of the bottle and resize it like so. Select the Quick Selection tool, choose Cloud, and click on Select Subject. Press Ctrl plus J. Change the blending mode to multiply. Select both layers and press Ctrl plus T to resize the image. Create a new layer. Press B and select a soft round brush. Adjust it like so. Pick a dark orange color and follow the process. You can resize your brush if needed. Press Ctrl plus T to resize the shadow. Create a new layer. Right-click and choose Create Clipping Mask. Follow the process. Reduce the opacity. Add a Color Balance Adjustment Layer. Create a Clipping Mask. Follow the process. Zoom in and select the Rectangle Marquee tool. Make a selection like so. Add a layer mask. Press Ctrl plus I to invert the mask. Create a new layer. Press B and select a soft round brush. Set the foreground color to white and follow the process. Change the blending mode to screen and reduce the opacity. Press Ctrl plus T to resize. Hold Shift and press Ctrl plus G. Name the group. Import the first fruit. Select the Quick Selection tool, choose Cloud, and click on Select Subject. Press Ctrl plus J. Change the blending mode to Multiply. Select both layers and press Ctrl plus T to resize the images.
Go to FX and choose Drop Shadow. Follow these settings. Add a color balance adjustment layer. Create a clipping mask and follow these settings. Add a hue and saturation adjustment layer. Create a clipping mask and follow these settings. Hold Shift and press Ctrl plus G. Name the group. Import the second fruit. Select the Quick Selection tool, choose Cloud, and click on Select Subject. Press Ctrl plus J. Change the blending mode to Multiply. Select both layers and press Ctrl plus T to resize the images. Go to FX and choose Drop Shadow. Follow these settings. Right click and choose Create Layer. Add a color balance adjustment layer. Create a clipping mask and follow these settings. Add a hue and saturation adjustment layer. Create a clipping mask and follow these settings. Hold Shift and press Ctrl plus G. Name the group. Import the third fruit. Select the Quick Selection tool, choose Cloud, and click on Select Subject. Press Ctrl plus J. Change the blending mode to Multiply. Select both layers and press Ctrl plus T to resize the images. Go to FX and choose Drop Shadow. Follow these settings. Right click and choose Create Layer. Add a color balance adjustment layer. Create a clipping mask and follow these settings. Add a hue and saturation adjustment layer. Create a clipping mask and follow these settings. Hold Shift and press Ctrl plus G. Name the group. Import the palm tree branches. Resize the image accordingly.
Go to Filter, Blur, and choose Gaussian Blur. Set the radius to about 4 pixels. Add a hue and saturation adjustment layer. Create a clipping mask and follow these settings. Adjust the image if needed. Add a curve adjustment layer. Create a clipping mask and follow these settings. Hold Shift and press Ctrl plus G. Name the group. Add a gradient adjustment layer and follow the process. Reduce the opacity. Add a color lookup adjustment layer. Choose crisp warm look. Reduce the opacity. That's it I hope you enjoyed it. Subscribe to my channel for more tutorials. Also, check out other videos on my channel. Thank you for your support.